Kyle, thank you very much. Word in tonight, unfortunately, that we've learned now that a 19-year-old Cedar Rapids woman has now died, and a local TV weather anchor is recovering following that two-vehicle crash in Marion that we first reported on Saturday. The teenager has now been identified as 19-year-old Zoe Norton of Cedar Rapids, a University of Iowa student that worked at Culver's in Cedar Rapids. She died from the very serious injuries she suffered in that accident yesterday. Marion police say that somehow Zoe lost control of her vehicle and crossed the median into the oncoming traffic, slamming into a pickup truck, which was driven by television weather anchor Justin Roberts of local station CBS2, that's KGAN Television. All this happening along Highway 1 in Marion at about 11 o'clock late Saturday morning. KWW's Justin Andrews is live for us tonight near that crash scene. And Justin, obviously a very, very tragic situation for the Norton family. You were able to speak to Zoe's grandmother today. Yeah, Ron, and she was visibly shaken up. She says her granddaughter was very artistic, full of life and feisty, and now she says she would do anything to have her 19-year-old granddaughter back. Make sure they know how much you love them. A grandmother grieving. She left to go to work. It was raining, and I'll see you about 10.30. Joan Adams aching with so much hurt and pain, she understandably didn't want to show her face. She says her feisty and artistic 19-year-old granddaughter, Zoe Norton, left the house, headed to Culver's where she worked, and minutes later, Adams heard sirens and got a gut feeling. And they had already taken her away. And I saw the car in pieces all over. Pieces scattered across Highway 100 in Marion after a head-on collision. This is video of that crash scene CBS2 shared with us. A crash killing her lovable granddaughter and injuring CBS2 weather anchor Justin Roberts. We're grieving. She's much too young to have lost her. Marion PD tells us the car Zoe was driving was going east on Highway 100, somehow lost control, slid across the median and into the westbound lane, slamming into 31-year-old Justin Roberts' truck. Roberts posting on Facebook saying his right hand is broken and has a fractured sternum, a nasty crash, leaving Roberts injured and a family trying to cope with it all. Kevin got a feisty angel picking out close the funeral. Wow. Now, right now, Marion's police department, they're still looking into exactly how Zoe lost control of her vehicle. As for CBS2 weather anchor Justin Roberts, he posted on Facebook, he's alive but sore. My thoughts and prayers to both Justin Roberts and especially Zoe's family. We've got you covered live along Highway 100 in Marion. I'm Justin Andrews, KWWL News. Yeah, obviously the same sentiments here, Justin.